Alright, I'm going to try and make this brief because it is late and I am very tired. Um, let's see. Tried to get going early this morning and did okay at that. Um, but then, uh, well, it, it rained pretty good for a bit. You know, probably about you know 15 minutes. And, uh, you know, I got a, a, another thorough soaking. Um, kept going. Uh, then, you know, as per usual at this point, uh, the rear tire went flat, um, you know, pulled it off. I mean, I checked for punctures before I pulled it off and didn't look punctured. Um, so when I pulled it out, the tube had a, uh, a hole on the inside of the tube. You know, usually the puncture punctures the outside, you know, so here's the outside. It was on the inside, inner, inner part of the inner tube. Um, so, which I thought was strange, um, probably had something to do with, uh, you know, maybe the, um, rim tape or something like that, but, um, I was hoping, you know, I thought it might seal up, you know, pumped it full of air, didn't seal, you know, so I, I took it out, and then as I was, was about to put a new tube in, you know, the tire, the tubes seemed to be holding pressure, you know, like it was sealing up, so I put it back in, ran with it, you know, for, um, you know, probably another, you know, 20, 30 minutes, um, in the rain, um, again, after the first soaking, uh, and then, um, you know, it, it died again, so, stopped to, to change the tube, and, um, you know, I'm just kind of taking my time, and, you know, a couple people actually stopped to see if I needed help, one guy, I think he saw me earlier changing it, and then saw me, you know, mucking with my bike again, um, actually, and another guy stopped at the same time to ask the same thing, um, and, uh, I said, no, I was fine, and then another, another lady, I, uh, Mary Margaret, I think her name was, I wrote it down earlier, um, uh, stopped to ask if I was alright, and we chatted, and, you know, that was, that was very nice. Um, so I didn't go my exact route, and, you know, I decided, you know, to kind of make up some time and, and head straight into Florida, into Pensacola, um, which I did, um, and then I stopped by the bike shop to pick up some extra tubes and a new tire, uh, but they were very busy, so I ended up spending about two hours there. Um, got going again, um, you know, headed down to Pensacola Beach, uh, which was nice, um. I decided not to stay there. Uh, you know, it was quite pricey. I think it was like most of the places are like $200 a night. So, um, yeah, so I, I was, you know, riding down uh, the road there, and I guess they have areas marked off that for bird nesting. Um, anyway, um, so, you know, I thought nothing of it. It's like, do not enter bird nesting. Um, I should probably keep doing that. Uh, so, I'm like, all right, whatever. And, you know, um, basically just like when I was go over, you know, go on the overpasses and the birds would, you know, kind of launch fighters uh, whenever I approached or was going by. Uh, these birds did the same thing. Except the only difference is they dove at you. Um, and I, I don't mean like, you know, they're kind of up above and they come at you and fly away. I mean, they, they were, they got within a, you know, a foot or two of my head um, with claws out, you know, like basically, you know, that sort of thing. And so you looking behind, you know, I was looking behind me and just seeing this bird just kind of, you know, and then kind of, you know, float back. I, I didn't know if I was outrunning them because I was pedaling my ass off at that point. Um, I didn't know if they were, I didn't know what the deal was, you know, if they were actually, you know, just trying to be a, do a show of force, um, or if they were actually, you know, would attack. Yeah, and I'm, you're tired. You know, I'm tired. And, you know, I, I really have no interest in finding out or, you know, figuring out whether what they're doing. So, um, yeah, so that 
I had to deal with that for about five or six miles. Um, you know, and, and here's the, here's the thing is, you know, like I hunkered down and I, I got up to, you know, 25, 30 miles an hour and they were matching my speed. Um, uh, it must've been a tailwind or something, I hope, but, um, that was not a fun experience. It was extremely exhausting. So, you know, yeah, I look behind and there's birds coming at me and, you know, coming from the side, coming from the back. You know, I've got my little rearview mirror, you know, on my helmet and seeing a fucking bird, you know, uh, <laughs> come at you was just, <laughs> I don't know, just icing on the cake, I guess, for this trip. So, anyway, um, I got to figure out what I'm doing. Um, you know, I'm going to. Yeah, I gotta figure out, you know, how to get everything home. So, um, you know, I, I didn't need to be in Jacksonville on the 6th. So I will probably have to change up the routing a bit and instead of going through Panama City, head up towards Tallahassee. Um, because, you know, it'll cut down some of the time. So, anyway, uh, you know. Three more days.